Hello and welcome back to Rick's Kicks. Well this is fun. This is where we are with the uh, owl clock and timer. Um, we've got our very nimble fingers I think for this build. And I certainly wouldn't want to be a clockmaker or a watchmaker. Um, this isn't very far from completion, but I've still got these hogs and that to get in. Um, yeah, it's interesting. Okay, I'm literally, <clears throat> let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen steps away from having this completed. I don't want to move it to, would move it about and show you what's going on, but if I do, it's going to go, it's spring loaded in here and here. So, yeah, that's where we're at at this moment in time. So, I'll come back to you when. Uh, it's complete in a bit. Hello and welcome back. So here it is. This is the finished product. Just over ten and a half inches tall. You can see the uh hands are whizzing around. Here we've got the pendulum. The pendulum is nothing to do with the actual clock itself. It's to do with the timer which is on the back. Um, you've got a weight in, in there which you uh, have to adjust to try and uh, get it to time right at this moment. It's not timing right, it's either running fast or it's running extremely slow. Um, yeah, it was a pretty fun build, I must say, but you definitely need a few extra fingers or maybe an extra pair of hands in places it was a little bit, a little bit, uh, oh, I see getting some of these cogs and things in the back. Turn this around. I can show you the, the timer section. This is the timer on the back. Make sure I get my fingers out of the way of the, uh, what you do is you wind this Wind this spring up here, which is already round up. But here's your timer, so you've got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, actually 30 minutes. Um, so let's click around about 5 minutes. You won't do anything on a side. And then using this key down here, you wind the spring up on this side, set her in motion, turn this side away. Yeah. Movement. It's quite good on the other side with the bell. It's there. So you've got countdown time. Yeah, I can assure you that <laughs> not correct. It's not uh, firing correctly on cylinders. It's actually not moving. I have. Uh, I know it is. Let's turn it around while she's spinning. It doesn't matter if it's fucked up. Okay, so I see it.
Nations. Cloak. Cloaks. Cloaks turning inside. They're all waxed up. They've all got wax on them. Needs a little bit of refinement. So yeah, that's the uh, owl clock. Nice, nice fun little build. And it can serve well. You're not going to serve a purpose with me with the timer, but stop that for a minute. But it certainly serve as an ornamental block for the front room for now. Okay. So that's a that's a R O K R or rocker mechanical owl timepiece. Thank you for watching. I appreciate all my subscribers, old and new. So something different. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.